I'm, I'm finding out the value of taking frequent and long breaks when I do this. <laughs> frequent and long breaks really help a lot, and also gargling. <laughs> I've found <laughs> gargling helps a whole lot if you can do it without that sensation of choking. <laughs> but anyway, hello, I'm Glasses Geek, and this video, it might be really short. I'm going to say it's probably going to be really short, but I don't know if it is. Um, but for better or for worse, I've decided to come out of the closet. I need to, with, with my health scaring me so bad and getting so sick, I knew that I couldn't pass away without making this video and telling the world. And I've been terrified to say this, but so many people in real life have already picked on me very, very hard for whom what I am. They hate me for being a woman. They hate me for being a northerner, quote unquote. They hate me for being a, quote, Yankee, unquote. They've straight out told me that they hate me for existing. So, you know, and that's in real life. And that's been ever since I was a kid. The adults have told me that. My own family has told me that. So... So why not tell the world? And in making all these videos, the worry of what people will say when I'm finally laid to rest, that has really worried me. Are they going to try to discredit me? Are they going to try to malign me? Are they going to try to... They, they've been constantly making me out to be... You know, they've been discrediting me in the only way that they can since they can't just punch me or hit me or have me arrested because, you know, freedom of speech still ex still exists in this country and freedom of belief still exists in this country and a lot of people don't like that idea. A lot of people don't like the idea that freedom of thought exists in this country and they don't like it when you go against their beliefs. A lot of people don't like it when you take the scientific route or when you question religion or when you question the church. And I have since day one. My parents have very much hated me in that. They don't like it when you question politics. And my parents have hated me for that since day one. They hate it when you actually do what they say instead of what they do. You know, the old saying of, do what I say, not what I do. Well, I finally started doing that when I was very young, and I got in even worse trouble than I was before. So... And that's another social aspect that I don't understand, you know. But I wrote a poem to go along with that called, quote, lesbian, unquote. This is out of My Bests, a book of poetry that I published on Amazon. You can look it up. It's under Glasses Geek. So, anyway... Quote, lesbian, unquote. What will they say when I'm finally laid to rest? Will they twist, mar, and taint my last breath? Will they say I'm worthless because of my orientation? Just because I found elation in. I cannot. That's it. That was all I had of that poem. I, I realize I should expand on it, but what that is in relation to is that I don't want people saying the wrong things about me. I don't want them believing that I'm prejudiced. I don't want them believing that I'm conservative. I don't want them believing 
that I'm against anyone, men or straight people or being straight. I don't want them to believe that I am against religion. I don't want them to believe that I'm a Republican, that I'm uptight. What I am is a liberal. I'm a progressive liberal. I'm for Bernie Sanders, and I wish he would have won. What I am is I am for LGBT, A, and Q2, questioning a queer people and rights and groups and individuals and beliefs and thoughts and walks and ways of life. I am for lesbians. I am for bi's, uh, bi people. I am for gays. I am for transgenders and transgender people. You know, I'm for uh, asexuals. I am an asexual. Uh, if I absolutely had to get married, if you put a gun to my head and said you have to get married to someone, then I would choose a woman. I would. I don't have a libido, and I'm just entirely asexual. Um. I'm for questioning and queer people. I'm for everyone who's bullied, everyone who's an outsider, everyone who's an outcast. I am for all the religions that are not of the established Christian religion in this country. I am for foreigners, I am for Muslims, I am for Mexicans, I am for outsiders, I am for Native Americans. Heck, I'm for extraterrestrials if they land here. Um, I'm for extraterrestrials and aliens and their rights, you know, <laughs> non-earthly aliens, meaning. Um, come to me, as long as I'm conscious and aware, I'll be your friend, to the best of my ability. <laughs> I might have to get used to you if you're an extraterrestrial, but, you know, I figure you'll have to get used to me, too. But, uh, <laughs> but all joking aside, I'm, uh, I'm for women's rights, I'm for feminism, I'm for feminists, I'm for freedom of speech, an expression. I am for, I'm for being progressive. Uh, I am for being politically correct, which I know a lot of people, but I'm also for telling good jokes. So, uh, I am for freedom of the press, but I see the press as nothing but storytellers who are just nothing but entertainers helping the already established, uh, ideas and beliefs prevail, which I don't like. Um, I am for all these people mentioned and others who are hated and outcasts and underdogs. You know, I'm for myself being an asexual lesbian and others who are asexual lesbians and other lesbians and gays and bi's and transgenders and questioning and queers and everyone, you know, Muslims and Mexicans and, Ma and Native Americans and, and women especially, being paid well. I'm for all of our rights in the working world and in the financial world and for equality in the working and financial world and in the business world and I'm for myself and people like me making a living off of our artworks, you know, me making a living off my artwork, my writing, you know, even my beliefs and whatnot, you know, standing up for my beliefs, making artwork in relation to my beliefs, making writings in relation to my beliefs, and being able to make a living off of that, you know, and I am for equality, human rights, I am for equal pay, I am for uh, being able to win your rights, not just stand up for your rights, but being able to win your rights. I am for Black Lives Matter. To the best of my ability and knowledge, I'm for black people and dark-skinned people. And I'm for all of these groups as long as they're for me. But, you know, I mean, what I'm really for is love and acceptance and understanding and welcoming and kindness, and gentleness, and softness, and overall welcoming, understanding love. And I'm for truth. And I couldn't die without making this video. I had to get this off my chest.
And by this age, I know that if you were hated and picked on when you were younger, you're going to be hated and picked on when you're an adult, and even when you're an older adult, which has happened to me my whole life so far. It's not the case of the cream rising to the top. You're not going to rise to the top. If you're on the bottom, you're going to stay on the bottom. And if you're on the top, you're going to stay on the top. And those who are doing the bullying and the picking on, they become the CEOs. They're the ones who decide whether or not to hire you. I found that out through living my life. And I know that this might, this might bar me from getting a job. But I don't care. I don't have any friends currently who could get endangered by this. I don't have any family left that can get endangered by this. My parents are far too old. The rest of my family, we're all estranged from each other. No one wants to have anything to do with each other, and I'm not even going to get into that. But they especially hate me, and it's because of this, who and what I am, and the way I am. My family hates me because I'm physically ill. They've hated me in the past because I've had terrible problems. The camera stopped. I don't know why. Well, I'm glad I got all that off my chest, and I'm glad I said that. So I guess if you're going to hate me, you hate me for being a lesbian. <laughs> Which I think is just wrong. You know? You shouldn't hate anyone for being a lesbian or gay or bi or transgendered or questioning or queer or... You know, or black or Native American or Mexican or foreign or Muslim or any other kind of unestablished or outside Christianity or religion and... You know, you shouldn't hate someone for being mentally handicapped or physically handicapped or also known as retarded. You shouldn't hate someone for being Asperger's or, or just not understanding social life and how to socialize, which is the way it's been for me my whole life. You shouldn't, un you shouldn't hate people for loving others and for fighting for their rights. You shouldn't hate people for being, you know, a woman or a girl or a female or... You just, you shouldn't hate people. You shouldn't pick on them, you shouldn't bully them, you shouldn't harass them, you should just... treat them well and love them. But that's what I believe. And so for better or for worse, I'm, I made this video and I'm putting it out there. These are my beliefs. This is whom what I am. And this is what I will fight for in my artwork, in my writing, in my videos. And heck, I've been so physically ill here and so not believed that at this point I'll even fight for people who swear up and down, forwards, backwards, and sideways that they've been beamed up by aliens and, and for people who know that Sasquatch is real and <laughs> know that the Loch Ness Monster is real. I'll even fight for you guys. <laughs> That's the only area I can go into that I see as funny at all, but... You know, if you believe it, then I believe you. And if you'll defend me and back me up, then I'll defend and back you up. I don't care if you're a right-wing conservative. I don't care if you're an up-ball liberal Democrat. If you agree with me and back me up, then I'll back you up. And if you financially support me, I'll back you up even more. <laughs> I, I got a joke somehow. This this video is so serious. But that that's it. I will take the financial support though. <laughs> but yeah. That's it. That's it. I just want to tell more jokes now. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Bye. At least I'm ending this on a... At least I'm ending this chuckling instead of weeping for once. I'm just glad for that. The video that I made... This video that I made previous to this one, it got so angry and so dark, and I was almost crying. I'm just glad I'm ending this on laughter. Thank God.
Bye. <laughs> I love you. Love me too, please. Thank you. Bye. Okay, here we go, the poem, Transgendered. Quote, transgendered, unquote. Am I woman or am I man? Why can you not understand? I am human, I am soul. I am not the names you call. Am I trans or am I queer? Why do you all point and sneer? I am human. I am soul. Doing these videos and this art is what makes me whole. Nearly bullied into my grave. Now I hope that I can save. Thank you.